It's time to play Family Feud. Get up for Steve Harmony. I appreciate everybody. I do. Thank y'all. Yeah, I do. Well, welcome to Family Feud, everybody. I'm your man, Steve Harvey. We got a good one for you for today. From San Antonio, Texas, it's the Diaz family. And from Alpharetta, Georgia, it's the Chester family. Everybody's here trying to win themselves a lot of cash. Some of them have a shot to drive out in a brand new car. Let's go meet the them. It's the Diaz family. Mm. Hey, Adolfo Senior. How you doing, man? Doing good. How are you? Good, good. Introduce to everybody. This is my beautiful daughter, Sarah. My baby girl, Elsa, who's a pool golfer. My handsome son, Aldo, pool junior. And my awesome, beautiful baby sister, Emma. Hmm. Welcome to the show. Hey, listen, stay enthusiastic. Have a good time. Win yourself some money. Hey, let's go meet the Chester family. Hmm. Hey Michelle, how you doing? I'm doing good, Steve. So what do you do for a living, Michelle? I work for Samsung Healthcare. I sell ultrasound machines, but I work here at Northside Hospital for about 25 years doing the ultrasound on moms and the little babies inside high risk. Yeah, that's pretty good. Well, Michelle, let's introduce everybody. Yes, I love to. This is my firstborn, my fabulous daughter, Hannah. And then I have the baby of the group. This is my beautiful bold Amelia, my second born is Bree, Bree, then she is my sassy little girl, and then on the end is my ex-husband and father of all of my three daughters. He's the F. Ob D name Don. That's what I use to res respond. You called him the what? Back in the day, the DNA donor, the DNA donor, DNA donor. That was back in the day when we were not on great terms. Now we're like good terms. Now he's the FOB. Uh, well, that's great. Hey, listen. Stay enthusiastic. Have a good time. Win yourself some money. Now, who wants $20,000? Let's get on. Let's play with you. Give me Adolf Sr. Give me Michelle. Folks, welcome to the show. Top eight answers on the board. Here we go. What might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Food, food. Pass the plate. 
play. They're gonna play. What might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Money, money. A million. Yeah, what might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Some hair, hair. Some hair. Braden, what might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? His condoms. His condoms. Ah. Larry, only one strike. What might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Pencils. Pencils. All right, Michelle, we got two strikes. We got to be careful. Diaz family can steal. What might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Dirt, dirt. Hannah, what might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Cell phone. His cell phone. Hmm. All right. Amelia. What might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Sweets. Sweets. Raiden, two answers left. You got two strikes. DS family can still be careful. What might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Cigarettes. Cigarettes. Larry, one answer left, but we got two strikes. Tissues. Tissues. Mm -hmm. ah. What might a guy with man boobs have in his cleavage? Some beer. Some beer. Mm -hmm. Yes. Hey, let's move on to question two. Give me Sarah. Give me Hannah. <laughs> Ladies, top five answers on the board. 
Name something that's fun to bounce on when you're young but dangerous if you're old. Yoga ball. Yoga ball. Trampoline. Trampoline. We're playing. All right, I got you. Amelia, name something that's fun to bounce on when you're young but dangerous if you're old. Bed. Bed. Brayden, name something that's fun to bounce on when you're young but dangerous if you're old. Pogo stick. Pogo stick. Larry, name something that's fun to bounce on when you're young but dangerous if you're old one has to love. A bounce house. A bounce house. Chester mm. family got 93. Diaz family got 77. The goal is 300 points. Don't go away. So we're coming right back right after this, y'all. Welcome back to Family Feud, everybody. We got a good one. Chester family got 93. Diaz family got 77. Give me Elsa. Give me Emilio. Ladies, points fairs are double. Top eight is on the board. My perfect mate wouldn't do what? Do much. Have a conversation. Have a conversation. Pass a play. Play. They're going to play. Adolf Full Jr. My perfect mate wouldn't do what to do much. Cry, cry. Ah. Emma. My perfect mate wouldn't do what to do much. Sleep, sleep. Ah. All right, now, Adolfo Senior, we got two strikes. We got to be careful. Chester family can steal. Spend, spend. Sarah, 
My perfect mate wouldn't do what too much. Smoke. Smoke. My perfect mates wouldn't do what too much. Drink. Drink. Number eight. Six. Five, three, two, Chester family got 173, Diaz family got 77, this is still anybody's game, we'll right back right after this, folks. Closed captioning is sponsored in part by, welcome back to the feud everybody. Chester family got 173. Yes, family got 77. Give me Adolfo Jr. Give me Raiden. Guys, points, fives, or triple. Top four answers on the board. Name something a woman buys when she wants to feel sexy. Makeup. Makeup. Perfume. Perfume. Pass the play. Play, we're gonna play. Emma. There's something a woman buys when she wants to feel sexy. Jewelry, jewelry. Adolfo Jr. Adolfo Senior One Strike. How about lotion? Lotion. All right. Sarah, one has to left. If it's there, your family wins the game. If it's not there, you're still alive. No strikes. Name something a woman buys when she wants to feel sexy. A thong. This is for the win. Thong. Proud of y'all family. Nice meeting y'all. Hope y'all have a good time. Y'all play very good. Hey, I need two of you. I got a father and son. We'll be right back to play Fast Money Ride through this, y'all. Welcome back to the feud, everybody. The Diaz family won the game. And now it's time to play Fast Money. All right, your son is off stage. I'm going to ask you five questions in 20 seconds. So if you can't think of something, just to pass. If you and your son together to reach 200 points, look right there and tell everybody how much you're going to win. $20,000. Mm -hmm. You ready? Yes. 20 seconds on the clock. We asked 100 men on a scale of 1 to 10, how much of a saint are you? 5. Name a holiday your friends celebrate more than you do. Christmas. Name a U.S. city where they seem to party a lot. Las Vegas. Name something people don't like to step on. Poop. Name a sport starting with S. Soccer. Hmm.
We asked 100 men on a scale of 1 to 10, how much of a saint are you? You said? 5, sir, I said. Then a holiday your friends celebrates more than you do, you said. Christmas, sir, I said. In the U.S. city where they seem to party a lot, you said. Las Vegas, sir, I said. Name something people don't like to step on, you said. Poop, sir, I said. Name a sport started with S, you said. Soccer, sir, I said. Duffel Jr. Yes. I have a son named Steve Harvey Jr. Just like your name. And I'm a senior just like your father is a senior. How much does your how much points does your father have? 135. Yeah. Your father got 156 points. You need 44 points. I'm going to ask you the same five questions. Don't repeat anything of your responses. You do, you're going to hear this sound. I'll say, try to get here another response. A little tough this got time. They give you 25 seconds. Ready? Yes. Reminds everybody of father's responses. 25 seconds on the clock. We asked 100 men on a scale of 1 to 10, how much of the saints are you? 5. Ah, <clears throat> try again. 6. Name a holiday your friends celebrate more than you do. Christmas. Ah, <clears throat> try again. Halloween. Name a U.S. city where they seem to party a lot. New York City. Name something people don't like to step on. Step on. Poop. Ah, <clears throat> try again. Bugs. Name a sport started with this. Softball. We asked 100 men on a scale of 1 to 10, how much of a saint are you, you said? Six, sir, I said. Five was the number one answer. Name a holiday your friends celebrate more than you do, you said. Halloween, sir, I said. Halloween was the number one answer. Name a U.S. city where they seem to party a lot, you said. New York City. We need eight points. Survey said. <laughs> Las Vegas was the number one answer. Poop was the number one answer. Soccer was the number one answer. Well, they did it. That's $20,000, and they'll be coming back to play Family Feud. I'm Steve Harvey. We'll see you next time, folks.